Today's sunshine note is titled, Going the Extra Mile. You know that you have been taught an eye for an eye and a tooth for a tooth, but I tell you not to try to get even with a person who has done something to you. When someone slaps your right cheek, turn and let that person slap your other cheek. If someone sues you for your shirt, give up your coat as well. If a soldier forces you to carry his pack one mile, carry it two miles. When people ask you for something, give it to them. When they want to borrow money, lend it to them. Matthew chapter 5 verses 38 through 42 He hit me first. I had every right to hit him back. I only shoved her because she shoved me first. But he started yelling and name-calling first and I was just giving him what he deserves. I only gave her a dirty look after she gave me one first. He started playing rough on the court first. I just gave him some of his own medicine. She gossiped about me first. I only gossiped about her to show her how it feels. Do these sound familiar? For some reason, we think that just because someone hurt us first, we're justified in hurting them back. Retaliate, pay back, give them what they deserve. But Jesus is asking us to do something different. He is asking us to go the extra mile and do what is hard. He's asking us not to return evil for evil. He is asking us to be kind instead. Don't mistake what today's text is teaching. Jesus isn't asking you to be a doormat and let people walk all over you. It actually takes a much braver and more mature person to choose not to fight back verbally or physically. So what are some alternatives? What do you do when someone hits you? You walk away and you report it. What do you do when someone shoves you? You tell them that was unkind and you walk away. What do you do when someone yells at you and calls you names? You answer calmly and you don't stoop to name calling back. What do you do when someone gives you a dirty look? You smile back at them. What do you do when someone is playing rough on the court? You show true Christian sportsmanship. And what do you do when someone gossips about you? You keep quiet and refuse to say something bad about them. I believe that with Jesus' help you can go the extra mile. You can use self-control. You can choose to be like Him. He treated everyone with respect and kindness. You know that you have been taught an eye for an eye and a tooth for a tooth. But I tell you not to try to get even with a person who has done something to you. When someone slaps your right cheek, turn and let the person slap your other cheek. If someone sues you for your shirt, give up your coat as well. If a soldier forces you to carry his pack one mile, carry it two miles. When people ask you for something, give it to them. When they want to borrow money, lend it to them. Matthew chapter 5 verses 38 through 42. May God bless you today.